Students, today let us learn about number bond. Look here. Here are two groups of butterflies. There are three butterflies in this group. And there are two butterflies in this group. So, how many butterflies are there altogether? Yes, altogether there are five butterflies. Now, let us use numbers to represent these butterflies. The number 3 for this group. The number 2 for this group. And the number 5 for the total number of butterflies. This image so formed is called a number bond. A number bond has three major parts. This is the whole. And these are two parts of the whole. Here, the parts 2 and 3 add up to make the whole 5. Or... 2 plus 3 equals to 5. Now look here. You can see two groups of balls. This group has three balls and this group has four balls. So, how many balls are there altogether? Yes, altogether there are seven balls. Now, let us use the number of balls to make a number bond. Three for this group. Four for this group. And seven for the total balls. Here, seven is the whole and three and four are its parts. Parts three and four Add up to give the whole 7. That is, 3 plus 4 is equal to 7. Now look here. Here you can see a figure and its number bond. Two parts, 2 and 5 of the number bond are given. But the whole part is missing. So, what is the missing whole part? In the picture, there are 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. 7 dolls in the whole part. 5 dolls and 2 dolls add up to make the whole part 7. 
So in the number bond as well, the missing part is 7. Parts 5 and 2 add up to make the whole 7. Now let us solve some of the number bonds. Look at this number bond. Here, parts 2 and 4 of the number bond are given. But the whole part is missing. So what is the missing whole part? 2 plus 4 is equal to 6. So the missing whole part is 6. Again, look at this number bond. Here, 2 and 7 are the parts of the number bond. And the whole part is missing. Can you say the missing whole part? Yes. 2 and 7 add up to give 9. So the missing whole part is 9. Midas E-Class Audiovisual Lessons for Nursery to Grade 10